Hi folks, it's Evo here from Thundermiss Lure Company and today we've brought a few Viper Spoons with us and what we'd like to do is share some tips and techniques on how to rig the Viper Spoon showing a variety of different baits. So folks, let's get started with the smallest of Viper Spoons, the size SP1. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is show how to rig uh, a minnow. This is an artificial minnow. I've got Claudio going to help me here. There you go, Claudio. So, whether you use an artificial minnow or a real minnow, this is how you want to rig it. So Claudio's going to poke it just through the top of the head there uh, on the very first hook of the Viper Spoon. Just like that. You don't, want to, you don't want to start it off in the middle. You want to start it right off on the head there. And then the next hook, he's going to take a look at where it's going to come out through the body and he's going to come through the top of the back with the hook, just poking it, impaling it through that particular spot because there you go there. So that's a nice job there, Claudio. What you see there is one perfectly rigged viper spoon. It's got a artificial minnow on there and you can see the hooks. He's left the hook points out so that they're, they're ready for hook setting action right there. So it's as simple as that. It's nice streamlined. It's going to make for a great presentation and fantastic action. Okay, Claudio, here's an artificial leech and you're going to rig that basically the same way. Eh? You're going to take it through the top, through the top of the snout, nice and close to the end there, poke it through, take a look at where the hook's going to come out again, and then mark your spot with your thumb, and then just quite simply poke it through again. So there you have it. Let's see what we have, Claudio. One perfectly rigged leech, and that could be an artificial leech, or again, it could be a, a real leech, but either way, that's perfectly rigged and ready to go. How about a crawler? Let's try a crawler, Claudio, a worm. Okay, so we have just a regular night crawler here. Claudio, you want to show how to rig that up? Now, you could use any worm, blood worms, whatever worms you have in your area, and again, it could be a real worm or an artificial worm. So you want to start it off right at the, right at the head of the bait there, poke it through once, and then take a look at where you want to rig it next with your thumb and then very simply poke it through again. Now with this smaller SP1, I think what we what we like to do, eh Claudio, is because that worm is long, take a look at that, how long it is, we're going to snip that in half. With this small SP1, you just want to use a worm segment. So just a little piece of worm, there you go, that's perfect. And I want to also point out the titanium wire line will not allow that worm to ball up into a ball which is very important when you when you move up to the next size of a Viper Spoon. So folks, there was a variety of baits. Choose your favorite bait, whatever it may be, cut bait, live bait, or artificial bait. Put it on the back of a Viper Spoon and get ready to fish the good life.